Hey, welcome to uh, Chris's Texas Sports Podcast. I'm uh, Chris, by the way. Let's get started. Astros outfielder Chaz McCormick uh, injured his right wrist in uh, Tuesday's loss to the A's. Kyle Tucker has been named the Astros nominee for the Roberto Clemente Award. Pitcher Justin Verlander's playoff rotation spot is in jeopardy after a troubling start. Rangers uh, pitcher uh, Jacob deGrom is set to return on Friday. Kamara Walker will uh, make his uh, ma- Major League debut for the Rangers on thir- tomorrow. The Rangers have a strong crop of uh, pitching of prospects. Marcus Simeon is the Rangers nominee for the Roberto Clemente Award. The uh, Texas Lady Longhorns a volleyball team lost to uh, Miami in an upset on Saturday, three uh, sets to two. They'll host uh, U of H uh, tonight in uh, Austin. The number uh, 16 uh, Lady Longhorns uh, soccer team beat uh, Long Beach State uh, 3-0 on Sunday. The Lady Longhorns got goals from uh, Lexi Misimo, Jilly uh, Shemkin, and Ashon Miller. The one also gave uh, Long, Lady Longhorns coach Angela Kelly her 300th career victory. She has won 140 of those 300 uh, wins at uh, UT. The, uh, the Lady Longhorns will host uh, Houston Christian Thursday, September 12th at Mike A. Myers, uh, soccer and Mike A. Myers Stadium and Soccer Field. The, uh, the Baylor uh, Lady Bears uh, volleyball team lost to uh, SMU on uh, uh, Tuesday uh, in uh, three sets to none. Baylor uh, Libero, uh, Lauren Brasinio, a senior, earned a Big 12 Defensive Player of the Week honors. The Lady Bears will host the uh, Baylor Invitational this weekend at the Farrell Center. They play LSU uh, Thursday, followed by uh, Stanford on Sunday. The Baylor uh, women's golf team is in uh, fifth place after uh, day one of the uh, Folds of Honor Collegiate on Monday. The Baylor uh, Lady Bears uh, soccer team lost to uh, Number 22, Iowa, 3-0 on Sunday. They'll host uh, Oklahoma State at uh, tomorrow on uh, at Betty, Betty Lou May soccer field to open a Big 12 play. Rice Volleyball hosted the Rice Invitational 2. They uh, beat uh, South Alabama three sets to nine on uh, Thursday. And they beat uh, UNLV uh, three sets to one on Saturday. They uh, play in the uh, Cardinal Classic in Louisville uh, start on Saturday against uh, Crichton, number nine, Crichton. You can watch that on ESPN+. Plus. It'll be at 10 o'clock in the morning. Rice uh, soccer beat uh, Sam Houston State 1-0 on Sunday. SMU Volleyball is hosting the SMU uh, Double Tree Invitational at Moody Coliseum this weekend. Also in the uh, tournament are U- Houston, Kentucky, and Purdue. The uh, SMU uh, men's golf team has a uh, share of fifth at the in- Inverness Intercollegiate Tournament in uh, Toledo, Ohio. That was a f- that was Monday, actually. SMU uh, volleyball middle blocker. Nnedi Akamore has been uh, named the ACC uh, Defensive Player of the Week. SMU uh, sophomore uh, Naya Rose and the rest of Team Canada have advanced to the round of 16 in the uh, 2024 FIFA Under-20 Women's World Cup on Sunday. SMU uh, women's soccer hosts uh, Stanford uh, Thursday in uh, ACC action. While the men's soccer team travels to the Bay Area to take on Cal in ACC action. The TCU uh, volleyball team beat uh, Minnesota three sets to two on a Saturday. On Friday, they lost to uh, Wisconsin three sets to two. They're now ranked number 25, and they'll play their first uh, home game this match uh, this year. Uh, let's see here.
Thursday against uh, they play the uh, they host the uh, fight in the forge uh, tournament against A&M Commerce, Prairie View A&M, and UCLA. Tomorrow and Friday. TCU uh, soccer host uh, Texas Tech uh, Thursday in uh, the uh, Big 12 opener for uh, both schools. So, at least I think it is. <laughs> the TCU uh, women's golf team won the Betty Lou Evans Invitational. Texas Tech uh, Volleyball hosted the Red Raider Classic and beat Northern Arizona, Florida Atlantic, and Green Bay. They uh, play in the uh, UTRGV RGV tournament at the uh, University of Texas Rio Grande Valley tomorrow and Friday. They play uh, UTRGV uh, tomorrow and A&M Corpus on Friday. Then after they play A&M Corpus, they play uh, Houston uh, Christian. Texas A&M Volleyball will beat uh, Texas State uh, Friday, three sets to none. They host the uh, Texas A&M Invitational at uh, Reed Arena this uh, weekend. Other teams in the uh, tournament are Temple, New Hampshire, and Louisiana. The uh, Texas A&M soccer team beat uh, Louisiana Tech uh, 2-0 on uh, Sunday. They play at uh, Central Connecticut State on uh, Thursday, and then play at uh, UConn on uh, Sunday. That's uh, at UConn. I found a uh, Rangers game on YouTube. They uh, played the Yankees on July 16th, 1983, at Yankee Stadium. It was on the NBC Game of the Week with uh, Vin Scully and Joe Garagiola on the call. That's back when uh, Buddy Bell, Larry Parrish, Billy Sample, Jim Sundberg played for the Rangers, and uh, Greg Nettles, Dave Winfield played for the Yankees. The Rangers were managed by uh, Doug Rader in his first season, and the uh, Yankees were managed by uh, Billy Martin, who was in his third stint as the Yankees manager. By the way, uh, Martin managed the Rangers uh, from 1974 to 1975 and led the franchise to its first winning season in 1974. 83 looked like it was going to be a winning season, but they had one of their uh, infamous midseason collapses. They uh, lost this game to the Yankees 3-1. Uh, they actually had one to nothing going into the uh, either the bottom of the 7th or the bottom of the 8th. They showed... Uh, First commercial was uh, the, the, whoever put it was uh, recorded off of WPXI in Pittsburgh, and whoever downloaded it kept all the commercials in, including the uh, local uh, promos and the network promos. As I uh, said before, I uh, first started watching uh, sports when I lived in Houston back in the late 70s. I went and saw the Astros uh, play in 78, and started watching the Oilers in 79. Also in 79, I watched some uh, Rockets games on uh, Channel 39 at uh, KHTV. The 79-80 uh, Rockets were uh, coached by uh, Del Harris. They played at the Summit. They had a record of 41-41, and finishing second in the Central Division and fourth in the Eastern Conference. In the playoffs, they uh, beat the Spurs in, in the first round. Then they were swept by the uh, Celtics in the uh, semifinals. Their games were broadcast on the radio on KPRC AM 950. The roster included Rick Barry for, at forward, Bradley Alonso at forward, Mike Dunleavy, who of course later became a coach at guard, Tom Henderson at guard, Major Jones at forward, Alan Lovell at guard, Moses Malone at center. Moses was second team all NBA. Paul McKeskey at center, Hall of Famer Calvin Murphy at guard, Billy Paul at center, Robert Reed at forward, Rudy Tomjanovich at forward, who of course coached them to their back-to-back uh, -back, uh, championships. Well, I guess I'll let you go now. Coming up on Friday, let's look ahead to the uh, football action with uh, the Texans and the Cowboys, as well as uh, UT and the other uh, college football action in Texas. My name is Chris Carlisle. 
I want to thank you for listening to my podcast.